Wow! Am I happy? Holy mackerel! Yeah, uh, Mahal is over there dealing with her mom. Her mom is very, 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 very out of it. And um, they're trying to arrange a funeral and stuff like that before they even have a funeral. And it's, you know, I'm like, wow, what is that different? But anyway, um, yeah, she's, uh, we, we sent her over to, uh, to be with her mom. And uh, she's happy and everybody's happy. And But I just did some scratches this morning and won $182 on scratch two tickets. Just two little tickets. Wow. Cool, huh? All right. Boy, the Nick Stock turned out to be a great concert last night. I mean, it was really good Friday because we played in it. <laughs> but last night with the Rods, I was rejuvenated. Those guys are in their 70s and they kicked butt. I mean, they made the 18 and the 20 and the 30-year-olds look like old bastards actually really i mean the, the, you know those ah, the rods are impressive as hell wow i was impressed and another band that was damned impressive you need to check out was called crash karma wow were they good holy shit i'd never seen them before but by the time the people that was sitting in front of the stage somebody knows about them no getting around that so I've been trying to get my phone back on, and I just can't do it. I mean, they told me to buy a SIM card. I bought a SIM card, and the goddamn thing won't work. Um, I don't know, uh, you know, I'm going to throw it up against the wall, see if that makes it better. But, you know, it's ridiculous. And they said I'll never have my old number again, so I'd have to put uh, all over the damn place for people that they can reach me at all. But, you know, what the hell you got to do? Politics still sucks. Boy, I, I, I you listen to some of the stupid asses on there. Jason Aldean, I love that song. You are really on the money. The hell with all the people that don't like it. I could give less than two shits about their opinion. Very impressive song. Try that in a small town. Yeah, you try that in a small town. Go ahead. Um, yeah, like really cool. Really cool. Um. You know, I met a guy yesterday, and he uh, he tried to convince me he was a Democrat, and then I, and after I blew his ass out of the water with uh, every bit of knowledge I knew about the pieces of shit, he uh, committed that he wasn't. He was a he, he he was a Republican. He just wanted to see if people would what would people would uh, say about it. So. I mean, we didn't threaten to shoot him or anything. We just basically said, you know, you're an asshole if you don't even understand how shitty your, your party is. And uh, and he did. He knew. And I was very impressed by that. So, you know, yeah. All right. So, and then I met some diehard MAGA people. They were cool at the concert, really. Um, yeah. It was, a, it was a good concert. really was. They had a lot of different bands. Some of them are very good. Some of them were, uh, were good. They were all good. What the hell are you kidding? There's no such thing as a bad musician. They have balls. They got up there. They did it. They requested to do it in front of people. What the hell? They were great. But I really, really like the Rods because uh, I, I followed them in the 70s. <clears throat> when I was with Razorback touring on the road, I followed them in the 70s. And uh, they were out then and I I talked to a lady. I bought a Rod shirt, and she said that they've uh, uh, been one uh, one Rod um, episode, and then the second Rod episode. Now I really I didn't know that, but I'm really happy to see them right back out there doing it again. Because by Jesus, they're good. They're really good. They're really worth seeing. They're, they're great stage showmanship. Uh, excellent players, and I stole everything I could from the guitar player and the bass player. <laughs> the drummer was exceptional. Now, I'm going to tell you something. There was a drummer at Nick Stop that was absolutely freaking mind-blowing, and I think he's the best I've ever seen. And that, I mean, I mean, he was great. His name, uh, the hell is his name? Um, well, that makes me feel dumber than a box of rocks. Um... Mm. 
It's right on the tip of my tongue, and I can't remember it. He's from Binghamton. Oh. oh, my God. Hang on. <laughs> 